And uh, so basically I did Google searches and did research and Summer Reif was married to Peter Sita and it's there's tremendous articles all over the internet the in, in regards to this. What is the relevance of the question because she's probably hired several people. So what is the relevance? Okay, what my relevance is and I would really appreciate it if you'd let me let me explain what I'm discussing. Get to the point, Senator. But she has ties to terrorism. And Peter, there's there's all sorts of articles. I only gave a couple. I only printed a few, but I have at least I would say a half Senator, a dozen of them. Senator, what you're saying is she has hired somebody that has ties to terrorism. I'm saying Summer Rife's husband, Peter Sita. There's lots of information, um, I, you know, in regards to her ties to terrorism. And, and, and I would really think that it would actually probably be helpful at this point if you could pass out so people could validate what I'm saying with, with articles. I will pass them out after the committee meeting, uh, mainly because I wanted her to have the chance to answer your questions at this point and not have the members sitting here reading things that uh, and you're not making a whole lot of uh, pointed questions so get to the question that you want to ask Samantha I did Turo. she's being quiet or she's deflecting or she's hiding no, I'm asking I'm asking fact you, that she can't answer questions you uh, I asked her not asked a question I yet. did you didn't hear what me. is the I question? asked her what she knew about summer rife and what she knew about Peter Sita if you have heard anything if you did you do de due diligence right. and vet her that was well, my question. Let's start there and let's see if this is a personnel matter that can be brought out in the open, yes or no. So, Samantha. Thank you, through the chair. Thank you, Senator Reinbold, for the question. I cannot speak to, based on my review of the Personnel Act and rules, um, to a candidate applicant, things of that nature. I think if you looked in the employee directory that is public, you would see uh, that individual, Summer Rife, is not currently employed with the Public Defender Agency. I can certainly speak to generally what I look for in candidates and how I hire. Um, of course, also by the Personnel Act, um, you cannot withhold an appointment based on discrimination based on protected class or specifically for classified employees based on their political views. That is in the Personal Act. I don't screen candidates for political views. What I do look for is people who are committed to the work that we do, who want to represent clients, who want to try cases. Um, we take great lengths to train our attorneys to be objective, to be strong advocates for our clients when we bring them in. Many of our attorneys are new attorneys, ideally if they already have the knowledge and skill set, uh, we continue to train them. And if I had a current employee that I had any concern that conduct either during state employment or outside of state employment negatively impacted their ability to do their duties as a state of Alaska employer as a public defender, I would take action to remedy that in the best interest of our clients. 